Head removal. So before this in, uh, video starts rolling, um, I realized I sped up this part a little too quick. Uh, first step to removing these heads, actually, uh, you know, I got the timing case all pulled apart here. To this is the original timing chain, so it has a fixed link on it. What you do is grind off the head and punch out the, one of the links, and then you can take the the chain off. Uh, you know, and then I'll show you later how to install it. So let's get this video rolling because it's kind of quick. But you see on the right height side head I ground off the the link pushing it out now chain is off and we're ready to go right side head is starting to come off uh, I believe it was a 10 mil hex on these guys uh, I was able to get in everywhere with a straight bit no ball in necessary uh, there's two sets of bolts you know per camshaft journal the one innermost is actually structural to the head goes to the block the one outside on the outer bank that just goes uh, for the journal to head. And we're about to yank this head off here. A couple more bolts holding it. Um, yep, there you go. All right, let's go in for an inspection. That looks nasty. You can see all the deposits in there. Don't worry about the liquid. That was my unseizing. What is incredible is the amount of crap in this cylinder. Wow. That's a mixture of ATF and diesel. That piston looks so nasty. Tons of just garbage deposits everywhere. And this piston. What would this be? Number, uh, I don't remember which side the head goes forward more. Let's call this piston four. Not too bad. Mine is being no, uh, crosshairs on the bore check out the head nasty nasty oh bingo there's your fucking problem bud the whole goddamn exhaust valve seat fell down and this uh valve train's all cut up now <laughs> wow all right now we're gonna take off the left head so it's the same thing pull the bolts off all right, let's go in for an inspection. Again, look at just all those deposits. This engine's been sitting, no wonder. It didn't want to bar over. This is a goddamn waste of Marvel mystery oil. If I knew how bad it was. And check out this head. These valve seats, exhaust valve seats are coming off as well. You know, this one's dropped down. These ones might be okay. But yeah, look at that. On, let's just say cylinder one. This would be cylinder eight, or vice versa, whatever, four, eight. Uh, that's, uh, now, uh, what I would like to know is, did these drop down first on both cylinder heads? Did these valve seats drop out on both cylinder heads first, or did something else happen? Did the rocker popping off, uh, you know, make this happen? I think the rocker popped off because of this, and, uh, yeah, I don't know. 